Gemini. Hi, it's Lisa here from What's a Name Tarot. I'm here to do your weekly reading for the week of Monday the 4th to the 10th of October 2021. These are general readings only, so just take with you what resonates. Check your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, any number synchronicities that may occur and cross watches are welcome. So there's only a couple of days left to leave comments on any of the videos throughout September. Be in the draw for the free yearly 2022 reading, which I will draw on the 18th of October. So, Gemini, let's begin. I'm going to take one because nothing's jumping out there. You get number 38, Lizard Spirit, Dream the World into Being. Can't see very well with the reflective light, but Dream the World into Being. Make those dreams real. Dreaming correctly, allowing them to come to life. Love that. Again, nothing's really jumping out for you. <laughs> so you get the new moon in Gemini. Communication is key. So dream the world into being, but make sure that everything is clear about those dreams and um, that communication is key to bringing those dreams to life. Right, Gemini. Sun on the bottom just before I start shuffling. Boom, straight up there. Love that. Overall, Six of Pentacles, remaining in balance throughout the week, equal give and take of some sort of situation. Always say if someone's doing all the giving and no taking, it means that somebody else is doing all the taking and no giving. So make sure that things do remain balanced, that communication may be key right there. Past energies, very strong energy with three major arcanas. You've got the Hierophant, Strength and Justice, could be dealing with a Taurus, Leo, or Libra okay but took a lot of strength to stand up for yourself in the past towards some sort of situation but maybe legal maybe monetary and um, but coming out with that justice even though it took a hell of a lot of strength in the past to um, follow it through but you stood up for yourself right there and came out with that justice right there too present energies king of cups nine of swords two of swords okay in control of your emotions there's been a lot of stress a lot of anxiety possibly from whatever this had been working towards here but um maybe now feeling like you're at a crossroads because that's finally come through you've spent so much time having to battle your way to get that justice and now now that it's come through it's actually like well, now what do I do? Feeling like you're at that crossroads right there. We will clarify shortly. Future energies, three of pentacles, three of swords, the fall. Okay, putting the plans and details into place before you take that next leap of faith, that next risk or that next chance that you want to head down there. You have had a broken heart here, possibly due to a third party situation. It may still pertain to this past energy. Okay, very hurt there. But um, that may be around love, it may be around work. Somebody may have bought a home from under you that you wanted, um, taking credit for your work at, um, or for your success at work anything like that as well but um you finish with that full ready to take that leap of faith towards your next chapter so gemini let's see what the clarifications have Starting with the Six of Pentacles. Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, Six of Wands. Look at that for balance as well. Coming out with a victory, but definitely some sort of brand new chapter, brand new beginning here. 
okay possibly around love could be a job you love could be a home you love but it could be around love love could be a successful new start here and um, coming out with that victory as long as everything remains balanced love that Gemini past energies the Hierophant you've got the five of wands eight of swords six of cups yeah, possibly a lot of conflict and arguments and disagreements in the past here over which path um, you are heading towards. There might have been something or someone trying to hold you back. Possibly someone that was wanting to come back in here um, as an ex, reconciliation, and that may have brought things to a bit of a halt. Seemed like um, that energy was trying to hold you back from moving forward. May have caused some disagreements and arguments there. But you are clarifying the Hierophant, following your own heart, standing up for yourself there, and um, finding that other path, possibly there. Love that in the past strength you got the queen of swords princess of swords three of swords yeah more direct approach up front more brutally honest communication is key you may have actually just laid it out on the line said now look here this is how it is you've possibly been in that third party situation around there and um yeah but you're ready to take action heal that broken heart move forward past that does take a hell of a lot of strength but bring it on because you have that princess of swords and a different approach with that queen of swords very blunt very direct and justice you get judgment strength five of swords you just clarified strength so you've needed a lot of strength possibly in the past here but keeping an open mind not judging others but not letting them judge you either it's been a constant battle banging your head against a brick wall but you've come out with that justice with that victory even though in the past you've had to go through quite a bit there so onto your present energies gemini king of cups You've got the Six of Swords, Princess of Cups, Queen of Pentacles. There's love on offer here, and you may be willing to actually move forward here, even if it's done in secret. You may be offering love to somebody, they may be offering it to you, but you're proud of your achievements, how far you have come. You're um, starting to get that success coming in now, and possibly um, that Six of Swords may be around work, it may be a job offer, maybe in another town, another country, but there is movement happening now now being able to leave that past behind let's so come into this nine of swords eight of pentacles temperance knight of pentacles it's feeling like a very slow moving energy to be able to release all that's happened back here okay but it's keeping that energy moving even if it is at a very slow pace um, will pay off with the hard work that it takes to to get through that energy right there because it is happening so slowly it may bring in these sleepless nights this um, overthinking of things but um, take that because it that one flipped over but um, it may be just at a snail's pace with that knight of pentacles may also be like not rushing into things now just slow down after all that you have been through and take a breather and um, before moving with this next energy because you're clarifying this two of swords and you do have the world knight of cups knight of wands yeah there is a um this you know everything has happened for a reason I always say we don't know what that reason is but that world it is still moving it is still pushing you forward and there is this love here quite confident to work together here and um it is a rocky ride a constant rocky ride roller coaster but you've got that strength you've got that stability and most of all that determination to stay on board and focus on where you are actually heading towards lizard spirit dream that world into being starting to put that into plan now and um and make it a being <laughs> talking about plans three of pentacles future energies you've got the king of pentacles queen of wands ten of swords yeah and planning pays off big time getting control of finances everything's starting to fall into place inundated with all the success coming in towards you 
okay and having that confidence of where you do want to be heading towards you have that vision and bringing an end to the painful cycle that you have been through to get to this stage okay it's been a hell of a journey possibly and um, now things are starting to wrap up with all that crap from the past and all that pain and now ready to focus on something new maybe finishing this heartache here with the three of swords you've got the knight of swords look at that ten of wands and the hangman yeah you still may be feeling in limbo waiting for a decision to be made on what this next chapter may actually bring okay but that three of swords bringing an end to that burden of feeling like you're on this journey on your own but they've got the knight of swords where it's actually saying slow down we're talking about that with the knight of pentacles slow down and think it through don't be too hasty don't go rushing into things here but um, you are wrapping up this painful cycle this burden done and dusted but it may also leave you feeling like, well, now what? Because you've had that much focus back here on what you've been going through. Do you've got the full? Ready for this next chapter. Princess of Wands, the High Priestess, the Tower. Love that. Being able to release that energy. Things had built to a point and now that um, tower explodes, all that energy is released. Okay, and ready to build a solid new foundation. Take that leap of faith. You don't want to jump from the frying pan into the fire, so you're only letting your guard down slightly here, but you are quite a compassionate giving um, sign here and ready to share your dreams and goals, possibly with somebody, and but maybe not overly share with that high priestess as well, but very intuitive, very aware, and allowing that energy to be released now and start something solid. And the universe Gemini has to say princess of wands, eight of cups, princess of cups. And again, all about balance. You had the six of pentacles overall. You've got the princess each side of this eight of cups. Again, very compassionate energy, willing to share your dreams, possibly offering love to someone here or they're offering love to you. But first there is that emotional attachment that does need to be left behind. Possibly what you've been going through with that flow right there and this flipped over so we're going to actually take that one <laughs> from these ones which nothing ever wanted to even remotely look like it was jumping out for you <laughs> this kind of like pick me <laughs> and you've got choose for you spread your wings and fly loving that it's beautiful Especially what you have been through here claiming that victory overall so Gemini that's what I have for you for the week do hope it helped thanks for watching and I'll see you all next time see ya bye